greetings of the day children i hope you all are doing fine at your home now today we'll be doing practical of our chapter number 5 that is introduction to html in our previous session we have completed the theory part of this chapter today i'm going to tell you how you will do the practical related to the same chapter so for that we have done in our session that for introducing uh, for html document we have to do some coding so where we have to do the coding we have to do the coding in our notepad so what is your first step your first step will be to open notepad how to open notepad you click on the start option from there you will find notepad if it is visible there only you will click on the notepad option otherwise you will go to all programs and then you will search for the notepad so here i have already opened notepad and i have already written few coding now my topic of this document is my country india i am writing some paragraph related to my country india i have also inserted one pair two pictures related to india and i have written a paragraph uh, of my country india as you all know the html tags starts from your uh, first tag is your html which help us to identify that the document is related to html your web page then you all know that your uh, this contain two section your structure of html contain two section one is your head and the other is the body in head you all know the title comes Ah, uh, so see he here I have written the title as my first web page because I am creating my first web page here. You may use any of the title. Be specific with the title, opening tag, and the closing tag. With closing tag, always the front slash come. And after that, you will see that this section is closing. I have closed my head tag. Then another section that is the body color starting. now i have used here that if you know by default the color of web page is white but here i want my color my web page should come in pink color so i have written pink here and whatever the text i will write it should come with blue color otherwise the text come with black color only so my background color will appear pink in the document and text will come as blue now if you will see i have written heading 1 i have taken heading 1 with uh, my country india my topic name is my country india so i have used heading h1 h1 is the largest heading and then if you will see we have studied img tag is used for inserting an image and its attribute is src it help us to find the path from where we are taking a picture now if you will see this is the path it's a lengthy path because this picture i have taken directly from another web page from internet i have taken so i have copied the url from there and i have inserted here and i have mentioned that height should be uh, 200 and width should be 150 pixel and it should be aligned right means it should come uh, in the right side of my document after that is your this is your basically for inserting the uh, image this tag we use and then after that we i have written a paragraph india our country is a huge and beautiful land full of wonders and then if you will see after this line i have used another tag that is br tag line break tag it is an empty tag it only has starting tag it never has ending tag now after that i have used uh, another line from the himalayas to the indian ocean deserts of thar and the snowy mountains of sikkim it is a country full of landscape and beautiful people then i have again used another tag that is p tag this p tag stands for paragraph tag that means i want this paragraph this india is a unique country with diversity should come from the next line that is from the next paragraph and and uh, after this it is a container tag so it has a closing tag also for another paragraph if i want to show separate paragraph then again i have used another paragraph tag and then again i have used some lines for it it is the seventh largest country in the world it is also the second most populated country in the world india has diversity in language food folk dance clothes cultures and tradition I love. If you will see, I've not written anything here, and then I'm starting from the next line. I love my country, and I'm proud to be an Indian. And then this paragraph is closing here. 
Again, after this, I've inserted one image, and this image is there in my PC, in my computer. So I've copied the URL of this image. Now, how to copy the URL? See, if I will show you where is my photograph. Here is my photograph. Here is the photograph in this uh, image uh, folder and you will see this India is there. So now how to get the URL of this means how to find the exact location of my photo. Click on the right, uh, right click on the photograph. There you will find the property option. At last click on that property option and you will find see the location. Here is the location. This whole location you have to mention. And after this, you have to mention the file name. This you have to mention and then you have to mention the file picture name that it is India. So you will see in my document, I have mentioned the same URL and then I have written India.jpg. Now the height and width again I have mentioned and I have written align bottom means it should come at the bottom of the web page. Then the body uh, section is closing and then HTML uh, section is closing. After that, what you will do, you will go to file option and you will save the file. Write the file name by which you want to save and then uh, with that you have to mention the extension also that is .html. If you will not write the extension, then your file will not appear as the web page on the web browser. After that, I have saved my file with the name inserting image. Now, if you will see. I have saved my file and if you will see, see here, this is the web page, uh, the shortcut of the web page is appearing on my desktop and see, my country India is coming in the bold, that is the heading. Now if you will see, India, our country is a huge and beautiful land full of wonders. After this, I have used a BR tag, that is why from Himalayas to Indian Ocean, it is coming in the next line. After this, India is a unique country. Before that, I've used the paragraph tag. So you can see the line gap is there between this paragraph and this paragraph. It is because I've used the paragraph tag. Again, here I have used the, it is the seventh largest country uh, paragraph uh, tag I've used here also. And for this image, I've aligned the right side. That is why it is coming towards the right side. And I've aligned it to the bottom. So that is why it is coming in the bottom of my web page. And you can see the image width and height also. I have used different height and width. So the size of the image, both image is different. And you may also see the whole letters of this India, our country is a huge. I have written in caps lock means the capital alphabet I have used. And for this paragraph, I have only written it in a normal text. So see the difference also. So whatever the text you will mention here in whichever format, if you will see, see it is written in the small alphabet. And all these tags are used, uh, written in the capital. Uh, all this text is used in the capital alphabet. So you have seen the difference in my web page. There, so whatever the formatting you will do here in that particular way only your web page will appear. Now here I have shown you the shortcut. Now how to view if uh, your that shortcut is not appearing on the desktop. What you will do? Click on the Internet Explorer. Then Control plus O from your keyboard. Uh, dialog box will appear. Write the name of the file by which you have saved your file. I have saved it with inserting image. Click on browse option. When you click on the browse option, another dialog box will appear. You have to search for your file where your file has is saved. Here is my file. I click on it and I'll click on open document. Then click on OK. See, the web page will come in front of you on Internet Explorer as well. It appear on Chrome as well as it is appearing on the Internet Explorer. So in the same way, you will do your activity. Thank you. Have a nice day.